Item number, SCP-3613. Object Class, Euclid. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-3613 instances are to be kept in standard humanoid containment cells on Floor 19 of Site-88. Under no circumstances are the location of these objects to be disclosed to any agents of Marshall, Carter, and Dark. Footnote 1. Documents relating to this group of interest are available upon request. Physical testing of SCP-3613 instances requires permission of the SCP-3613 project head and Site-88 director Philip Foster. Description: SCP-3613 is a collection of four humanoid robots, possessing the instance designations SCP-3613-1 through-4. While these instances are theoretically capable of anomalous physical and mental performance, none display abilities above that of the human baseline. These instances also express a belief that they are the immediate family of an individual identified as Jacob Jefferson, a known agent of Marshall Carter and Dark. On October 31, 2013, Jacob Jefferson and his immediate family were the victims of a traffic accident. Mr. Jefferson was the only survivor of the incident, suffering a Class A spinal cord injury which resulted in tetraplegia. Mr. Jefferson has since fully recovered from these injuries. Documentation recovered from Anderson Robotics. Footnote 2, Group of Interest 1115, indicates that the SCP-3613 instances are part of a family replacement program initiated by Marshall Carter and Dark in order to ensure employee loyalty. The following communication was intercepted on November 8, 2013. Dear Mr. Carter, I'm going to be honest. Hearing that you were interested in our androids for the purpose of replacing family members gave me pause at first. Once your assistant explained the purpose and process though, I have to say, this is an ingenious idea. Your agent, Mr. Hazemkal. Footnote 3. See Incident Report 2987-24 for more details. Deliver the Jefferson family's spirits this afternoon. We'll be loading them into the Generation 3 models tonight. By tomorrow, this man should have his family back. I know this is just good business for you, but it's always a joy when good business and doing the right thing align. Please give my best to Mr. Jefferson. It's ironic that he's got a much longer road to recovery than his family, but at least they'll be there to get him through it. Anderson. SCP-3613-3 was damaged cosmetically during a bullying incident at Gulf Shores High School in Baldwin County, Alabama on March 18, 2015. Police reports of the incident led Foundation agents to the hospital, where the damaged instance was being treated. The follow-up investigation resulted in all instances being identified and captured. During this incident, Mr. Jefferson was acting as head of security at a Marshall Carter and Dark auction in Atlanta, Georgia. Level 3 Access Required Absent a direct request from Marshall Carter and Dark, the Foundation is under no obligation under the SUS EOCT to return their property. Footnote 4 SUS EOCT Southern United States Extranormal Organization Cooperation Treaty The Foundation's capture of the SCP-3613 instances was therefore kept classified in order to avoid an incident. During this incident, Site-88's Director Maddox was in the process of being replaced by Dr. Philip Foster because of Mr. Maddox's duplicity in regards to Project Alpha-9 and the incidents of Incursion 8804. Footnote 5. Please see relevant documentation for more information. It is believed that Mr. Maddox revealed the location and status of the SCP-3613 instances at this time to agents of Marshall, Carter, and Dark. The following message was received very shortly after Director Foster took full control of Site-88. Dear Dr. Foster, it has come to our attention that you are currently in possession of our property, designated by you as SCP-3613-1, 2, 3, and 4. Our organization is invoking Clause 3, Section 5 of the SUS EOCT and making a formal request for the return of the following property. A Generation 3 Anderson Robotics Android appears as, identifies as, and possessed by the spirit of a 39-year-old female named Dolores Jefferson. 
a damaged Generation 3 Anderson Robotics android, appears as, identifies as, and possessed by the spirit of a 16-year-old female named Alice Jefferson. A Generation 3 Anderson Robotics android appears as, identifies as, and possessed by the spirit of a 12-year-old female named Tracy Jefferson. A Generation 3 Anderson Robotics android appears as, identifies as, and possessed by the spirit of a 7-year-old male named Jacob Jefferson Jr. This property is to be returned at your earliest convenience. A bill for housing, recovery, and transportation costs should be presented no more than 30 business days from the receipt of this message. Sincerely, The Office of Mr. Dark. Level 4 Access Required The Foundation Legal Department issued a formal denial of possession of these instances in order to delay their return and recommended an acceleration of SCP-3613's research schedule. On January 9, 2016, a convoy transporting the instances from Site-88 to Site-19 came under attack by a group of mercenaries, believed to be connected to Marshall, Carter, and Dark. This attack was repelled, the instances were returned to Site-88 for security reasons, and several of the mercenaries were captured. Among those captured was the operation's leader, Jacob Jefferson. A full physical examination of Jacob Jefferson was immediately carried out in order to determine the manner by which his spinal injury was treated. However, no signs of the spinal injury were present. Mr. Jefferson resisted interrogation, and refused to respond to requests outside of his own demands to see his family. On January 11, 2016, the following message was received from Marshall, Carter, and Dark. Dear Dr. Foster, Despite your previous denials, we are certain that you possess our property. Your organization has until February 15th of this year to return all property under previously received requests, specifically the Generation 3 androids designated by you as SCP-3613. Failure to return our property will cause a triggering of the penalty clauses of the SUSEOCT as outlined in Clause 10, Sections 1-87. through 87. We have also identified the following property as in your possession and are formally requesting its return. A Generation 12 Anderson Robotics Android appears as, identifies as, and possessed by the spirit of a 41-year-old male named Jacob Jefferson. A bill for damage, housing, recovery, and transportation costs should be presented no more than 30 business days from the receipt of this message. Sincerely, The Office of Mr. Dark. Thank you everyone so much for watching, and a huge thank you to all of my patrons on Patreon. Special shout out to Lesby Friends, Alexis the Great, Everborn, Joe Light, and Doomsday LLC, Prince and Design. If you'd like to help support the channel, head on over to patreon.com/drmaxwell. Link in the description.